I fucked them all. Soder, Big J, Shane Gillis. Uh, I'm Josh Adam Myers, and I'm here to answer the internet. If you could have an endless supply of anything, what would it be? If I was an, still a drug addict, I would say uh, Percocet 30 milligrams. They are, they are the greatest thing in the world. The shit you'll do for them is so bad. So if I just had them nonstop, well, that's the end. You're, you're, you wouldn't have to hurt anybody. It would be great. If you had to have a threesome with one male actor, who would it be? I don't know why Bob De Niro <laughs> popped in my head. It was like him or Pesci. Dude, that would be so cool. Just the <laughs> fucking... Just, just those three. Just, just three. You, Pesci, De Niro, and you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's two more. Wait, we're fucking each other? I'd fuck Pesci. Why not? Dude, it's a conversation starter at like a dinner party. It's like, well, you know I fuck Joe Pesci. What? You know what's funny? And I'll say this. I, this girl I used to, whose apartment I rented when I first moved to New York, uh, she's kind of a socialite. She's friends with all of us in the comedy world. Uh, she's only fucked three people in her life. One of them is Robert De Niro. Get the I swear out. to God. I swear to God. I have an ACI question. It's, uh, would you rather be able to, I think it's always drink without getting a hangover? Um, pull any girl you pull want. Pull any girl you want, like any girl at the bar, she'll go home with you. Or you get to be best friends with Joe Pesci. So I can either drink, never get a hangover, fuck that. Pull any girl mm -hmm. at the bar that I've ever wanted, or, or fuck Joe Pesci. Be best, well, whatever you want. <laughs> the question says Joe be, uh, be best friends with him. You don't. But, oh, be best. Yeah. Well, I mean, that's what my friendships are like, dude. <laughs> we fuck. Oh, we fuck. I fucked them all. Soder, Big J, Shane Gillis. It is funny that he thought it was fuck. He was going through it. Like, all right, so fuck an un unlimited amount of girls or Joe <laughs> I mean, how can you not say pull any girl that you've ever wanted to pull? I mean, you that's all. Because that's, but also that's the way it should be. Like, I, I was thinking about it. It's like, we should be fucking so much more than we do. We have such a short time on this earth. Like, there's no reason that I couldn't just go up to a girl at Chipotle and be like, you're really hot. We should, uh, would you want to go fuck? I'm not creep. No, I'm like, I have a, have a job. Okay, yeah. And then we just go. So I can, ah. So yeah, pull any girl. But I, but like once, but it was really tough to get not fuck Joe Pesci. You'd be fun, man. Would you rather fuck a chick who's banged a thousand dudes or a chick who's banged one animal? Come on, dude. One animal. <laughs> Easily, dude. There's antibiotics. This is a good one for me. Would you rather orgasm every time you hear All Star by Smash Mouth or hear All Star every time you orgasm? Dude, hearing All Star every time I orgasm would fucking rule. Dude, just, you just, ha, ha, hey now. <laughs> Somebody once told you the world. Dude, I, 100%. There's actually a really great video uh, of uh, the lead singer drunk at a, at a, I think, he, well, I don't want to say the wedding because it's, it's somebody famous that hired him, but he had like a full drunk outburst. Uh, but yeah. They were like the wedding band? They hired him. He spent like wow. twenty thousand, thirty thousand dollars for them to come and play like three songs, yeah. and instead he just got tanked and just caused a scene. Wouldn't get off the stage. <laughs> He's cussing like "fuck this," and you're like, "It's a wedding, dude. What are you doing?" It cool. sucks to the person getting married. Yeah. To everybody else, like this is the greatest <laughs> wedding yeah. I have ever I'm been to. It's like, honey, I'm. It's. I'm, I'll, I'll get him to stop. You turn around, your friends like this. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Keep going. Get him more drinks. Get him more drinks, dude. Would well, you guys have me? Do you guys put music on when you fuck? A Sonos used to sponsor my podcast, the 500. So I, so I just have like Alexa set up. So I'm just like Alexa, play Portishead or like Massive Attack. I've started getting into more 80s. So like The Cure. Yeah. The Cure's been good. Bauhaus. I'm into the dark shit, dude. <laughs> really, I, I'm I'm big into, into sex music. Yeah. Just not like it's not like pounding. Like it's not like I have like. It's like doing the beat. It's just, it's on. It's cause sex noises fucking suck, dude. Oh, man. Who is the worst group of fans? Uh, uh, 40 year old white women. 
<laughs> They're the worst. They're ruining comedy. You're gonna grow into one one day. Every weird outburst, every fan that I've ever had walk out of a show has been a, a white woman in her 40s, a drunk white woman in her 40s. They're the worst. Mm -hmm. And it's the ruining comedy. If you watch any comic, they will say 40 year old white drunk woman. In order for you to live, you have to kill a blind child who has the greatest voice of our generation. Are you killing the kid? In order for me to live? Yeah. Fuck that kid. <laughs> Fuck that kid. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. I can sing too. <laughs> I'd be like, ka, ka, ka. Oh, say, can you see? We good? We're good, right? Fuck that kid. Would you rather have no music for the rest of your life or have all music be sung by your significant other? Music is the most beautiful thing in the world. It's the, it's the one thing that it, it like... But it's been sung by, you know... Dude, if that's... But that's but the other option is I have nothing. nothing. I have no music at all. Mm -hmm. And it's like... I mean, the memories, it's still like, it's not enough. So if it's just like a really bad rendition of Hey Jude, I'd take it. Like, I just, eh, it's, it sucks, but man. <laughs> I mean, she's trying. I don't, I don't know. Like, she's... God, we can get you into some singing lessons or something. Is Eiffel Towering a chick with another guy gay? An Eiffel Tower is like, so I'm behind, he's in the front, and we just fucking high five. No, it's not gay. If we've learned anything from the TV show Euphoria, anything goes now, dude. Yeah, anything like goes. Not straight, it's, just it's just banging. Well, would you say, uh, you know, like, Good old fashioned DP is. Uh, two, put two. Rub your balls together with a guy. That's probably a little bit uh, homoerotic. It's a, definitely homoerotic. <laughs> two, two dicks going into the same you hole. I think the only thing that's gay is fucking a guy. Um. I think that's the clinical <laughs> definition <laughs> of it gay. It got me there. I, I think I don't think threesomes with two guys and a girl is gay. Unless the guys start doing shit to each other. Yeah, yeah I don't think... That's that's you start sucking the dude's dick. Wait, that's gay. Like, that's gay. Really if you start you're enjoying it, <laughs> yeah, that's it, it's yeah, gay, dude. It's gay. If, you're gay, if you're like, fuck yeah, let me, just, let me just flex a little bit to make it stronger so he feels like, I want this guy to oh. feel as good as I feel right now. <laughs> and you, yeah, totally straight away. You start pushing the blood there even more. <laughs> It's gay. <laughs> but there's nothing wrong with that. No. That's, there's that's nothing true. wrong with that, everybody. Would you rather give up the hungover breakfast sandwich or the drunk pizza? I would rather give up the drunk pizza because breakfast is the best meal of the day. I love pizza. Don't get me wrong. Pizza is the fucking shit, everybody. But, but I love like a bagel fucking uh, a bacon, egg, and cheese on like a whole wheat everything. Is my, that's my fucking jam. That's my fucking jam. But drunk pizza is the shit, though, dude. But also, I'll, I'll trade both those for, uh, for sober, late night high Swedish fish. Yeah. <laughs> you brought me back in. All right. <laughs> if you were born with, <laughs> this made me laugh already. If you were born with action figure hands stuck in same position forever, what position would your hands be in? It's on here, but <laughs> like, <laughs> this is just, this is great, dude. This is, you can still, Kind of, you can chopstick it a little bit. It's either that. Like a lobster claw. Right? Well, what's the other option? This? Well, there's so many right, options in the shop. Let me think about it for a second. Hold on. Let me really think also, about you it. You are exclusively thinking about fucking right now, aren't you? Yeah, but I'm also thinking about like I'm also thinking about like if there was a coffee mug I could like. So yeah. I'd want a little bit of a give in between. So really, this is kind of. I think this is what I'd want. Right here. Can we see it? With the gap. Between. With a gap. So then I can like hook shit. Yeah. That's the th hard thing. If the you thumbs look, out. Outside the box here. My dick's not that thick. <laughs> but I can make that work. Yeah, yeah. I can figure it out. Maybe like this. I think it would kind of have to be like this to actually yeah, be. I was gonna say, what about just a good old fashioned like that? <laughs> this is so you dumb. You there you go. Uh, yeah. But, 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 but see, there's just, it's got to be just enough space to get shit through. <laughs> for fucking... Would you rather be a pig and be able to orgasm for 30 minutes or be a lion and be able to have sex 60 times a day? That's a good question. I would still go with the lion because just the lion is like, 
the fucking, you know, most badass animal in the animal kingdom. So, like, even just outside the sex stuff, just because of lions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But then, but also, man, you ever seen what a, a female lion looks like? Dude, that's some good pussy, dude. <laughs> that is some good yeah, pussy. <laughs> Do you think Adolf Hitler was right for killing six million Jews? Why would you give this to me? Why would you give that to me? I'm Jewish. <laughs> would you watch a 25 minute dirty sex tape of your daughter for a million dollars? Where am I at in my life financially at the time? Do I need this uh, million? Right now, right now. Right now. And we, and we did specify dirty, because it's not like it's just like a She's laying there, and we're talking. She puts on performance. She's fucking? Yeah. There, there no. is a, I, I can't, man. I, I, I guess there's that minute, like, I'm like, make a joke out of this. And then I'm like, no, nah, I'm not a complete right, and utter like, pig. Five, I'm, <laughs> five million? Yeah. <laughs> All right, honey. Shake what your mama gave you, girl. <laughs> it's five million dollars. We doing pretty good. We are doing pretty good. Yeah, dude. dude. dude <laughs> that was awesome. All right, big thanks for watching ATI featuring Josh Adam Myers. Leave a comment below who you want next. Those are big shoes to fill, but if you know any comic or entertainer or, or celebrity that you think can follow up Josh's performance, let us know. Make sure you click subscribe so that you know that anytime an ATI video drops, you're there to see it.